That 90s show has a very diverse cast with interesting love lives, so let's find out if the reality is any different. Laura Preppen plays the character of Donna on the show, and she made an iconic comeback. Donna is married to Eric despite their differences, and she has a teenage daughter named Leia. Netizens are excited to see how Laura gives life to the classic character of Donna yet again. Not only this, but she's now 42, so it will be easier for her to resonate with her character as a middle-aged woman. A lot of fans still can't believe that Laura is in her 40s because of how radiant she looks. She started off dating Christopher Masterson, who also played Todd on that 70s show. Although he was on the show for only a couple of episodes, they continued dating from 1999 to 2007. She then had a long-term relationship with Scott Michael, and the two looked like a match made in heaven. But this didn't last long either because of their differences and they soon parted ways. Finally, Laura met Ben Foster, and the couple got engaged in 2016. It was soon announced that Laura is expecting her first child, and the two tied the knot back in 2018 in a very intimate ceremony. They're still very much married, and also share snippets of their happy life occasionally. Mila Kunis is also back on the show as Jackie, and the queen bee of that 70s show has now become a mother of Jay, and she's also back with her high school sweetheart, Kelso. We gotta say that Mila surely doesn't look like the mother of a teenager, but did you know that in reality, she's 39 and will turn 40 this year. Besides, the love life of Mila Kunis seems right out of a Disney story. She first met her Prince Charming Ashton Kutcher on the set of that 70s show. The two became friends but didn't start dating because they were with other people at the time. Ashton even dated Demi Moore and a couple of other celebs before he got together with Mila. After more than a decade, the two got together and realized that they had feelings for each other all along. They got in a really serious relationship in 2012 and hit it off immediately. The couple tied the knot in 2015 and are pretty happy with their two kids now. And did you know that Ashton Kutcher is also a part of that 90s show? Kelly Haverda plays Leah Foreman on the show, the smart and super cute daughter of Donna and Eric. The plot of the show revolves around her making new friends and finding her true self while also having fun. She starts living with her grandparents and life doesn't seem very easy for a teenager living away from home. Kelly looks really young and vibrant on the show and as a matter of fact, she's actually pretty young in real life too. The child star turned 15 recently and is still a teenager, just like on the show. She's a really young actress and has done a great job on screen but when it comes to dating, she's not publicly seeing anyone. This could be because she's very young and doesn't want to be involved yet. Deborah Jo Rupp is the mellow grandmother of Leia, and she's really happy to have kids running around in her house once again. But once the kids start playing around, she's going to have a hard time managing the house. Deborah looks so refreshing on the show that it would be hard for you to really believe that she's 71. But what's really shocking is that after all these years, she hasn't really been in a relationship publicly, nor did she ever get married. According to reports, she apparently had several relationships back in the day. However, she kept her personal life so private that little was known about her romantic adventures. Even today, she's mainly known for her work and not for her controversies or affairs. Kurtwood Smith plays a character of stern and obnoxious Red Foreman, who's not really on board with having teenagers back in the house. He wants them out and needs his peace, but his wife loves having some little ones around. The real age of Kurtwood Smith is 79, and he's a really sweet person in reality. But he also plays the rude character of Mr. Red really well. His personal life has also been full of twists and turns since the very beginning. He first got married to Cecilia Souza, but things didn't work out between the two, and they soon got separated. Then, in 1988, he got married to Joan Perkle, and the couple have been together and very much in love ever since. Topher Grace plays the character of Eric, the nerdy father who lives in Chicago with the love of his life Donna and his daughter Leia. We see a reflection of Eric's character in Leia, and the two go through some pretty similar experiences. The charming actor recently turned 44, and he looks just as glamorous as ever. Topher's relationships have been quite a roller coaster, as he started dating back in the 90s and only got into a serious relationship a couple of years ago. Grace met the love of his life, Ashley Hinshaw, back in 2014, and they started dating right away. Only a year later, the two were engaged, and in 2016, Ashley walked down the aisle. The couple soon welcomed Marble Jane, their firstborn, and are living a dreamy life ever since. Ashley off to Hyde plays the rebellious character of Gwen, who's confident and intimidating. She quickly becomes friends with Leia and lives in the exact same house where Donnie used to live. Her character is a combination between gothic and the typical girl next door. She started her modeling career when she was three, and she recently turned 17. She fits right into the character of a teen, and we're pretty sure that she's going to grace our screens for years to come.
The actress is currently single and there's not much information about her previous relationships. It looks like she's directing all her focus towards her career. Mace Coronel plays the character of Jay, the teenage son of Jackie and Kelso. He's an absolute dreamer and tends to live in his own little world. Jay is also a lot like Kelso and everyone is loving his character on the show. The young actor is 18 years of age and still single. However, he has had several relationships in the past. He's actually quite private about his love life so he doesn't share much on the internet. He doesn't even share information about his family and friends on Instagram. So, there's a high chance that he's keeping his relationships under wraps too. Sam Morelos plays the witty character of Nikki, who's got some pretty high ambitions and is striving to go to college and become a successful doctor. She's in a relationship with Nate, who's not very bright and often becomes a laughing stock even for Nikki. Her age is still 17 and she already seems like a rather mature and well-composed person. Sam has a charming personality, so one might assume that she would be currently dating. However, as it turns out, she's currently single. A lot like her co-stars, Sam has also kept her personal life very private and doesn't share anything about it on the internet. There isn't much information about her dating history either, and she doesn't post much about it on Instagram. Wilma Valderrama, playing Fez on the show, has become a local celebrity and continues to be close to the Foreman family. The fans are loving Wilma and his on-screen charm after all these years. In reality, Wilma has just turned 42, and he looks as vibrant as ever. When it comes to his dating life, he's gotten a chance to date some of the most famous women of his time, including Mandy Moore and Lindsay Lohan. He then went on to date Demi Lovato, who was a teenager at the time, and the two had an age gap of more than 12 years. They continued dating until 2016, after which they drifted apart. Wilma soon started dating Amanda Pacheco, and they got engaged in 2020. Within a year, Amanda was expecting their first child, and they're living happily together now. Andrea Anders plays the character of Sherry, who's the mother of Nate and Gwen. She's the lively neighbor next door and is very adorable. Her fans would be surprised to know that the actress actually turned 47 last year, but by the looks of it, she doesn't look a day over 30. Her dating life has been quite still since she met Matt LeBlanc in 2006. She definitely fell in love with him and the duo dated until 2014. Their relationship felt like the end game and they were all over the news. However, it all went downhill and the two started having arguments. They soon broke up and after this, Andrea hasn't publicly announced that she's dating anyone. And then we have Ren Doi, playing Ozzy, who's just trying to fight his way into this world so people will accept him for who he is. He's a really jolly and polite kid who just wants everyone around him to know that he's gay and still treat him the same, just like his friends. You would be very surprised to know that Ren is only 14 years old, although he looks like he's in his late teen years. He does seem composed and his acting skills are exceptional, even at such a young age. As he is so young, there's no reports of him dating, nor has he ever revealed anything of this sort publicly. For now, he's focusing on his career, and we've got to say, it's turning out great for him. So, who's your favorite from the entire cast of that 90s show? Tell us in the comments. Thanks for watching.